It all started with an individual, a problem and an idea. The problem, after much analysis, was that large-scale donor aid to governments and agencies just didn't seem to work as well as projects organized by committed individuals. The idea? What if we invested in citizens, ordinary people with enterprising ideas for real local change? People who saw social challenge as business opportunity. What if? What if there was a way to invest in, support and equip that person to not only start up, but to thrive? Since 2000, Unlimited UK has done just that for over 14,000 individuals across the UK who have impacted more than a million beneficiaries and created 45,000 jobs. From 2005, Unlimited India, social entrepreneurs have created 3,200 jobs and have reached more than 650,000 beneficiaries. In South Africa, the merged LifeCo Unlimited SA has reached 55,000 plus individuals across the country. 80 established entrepreneurs have operating enterprises, some with turnovers in excess of 5 million rand per annum, together creating more than 1,000 jobs. The aim is to continue to find, fund and support hundreds of passionate, enterprising individuals. Since 1997, LifeCo Unlimited SA has been convinced that champion mentality programs and entrepreneurship could address the dependency mindset and culture caused by generations of oppression, which have stifled meaningful achievement and enterprise in a free South Africa. LifeCo Unlimited itself an established social enterprise, uses business principles to sustain its social impact. It has operations nationally and has an excess of 60 institutional clients and partners. There are three LifeCo Unlimited Enterpriser categories for those who meet the criteria. Cash and support up to 45,000 Rand to community-based entrepreneurs, up to 85,000 Rand to more structured entrepreneurs, and up to 175,000 Rand to established, scalable entrepreneurs, all of which enables a passionate social or environmental entrepreneur to try it, do it, build it. It all started with Charles Nyakurwa, a LifeCo Unlimited enterpriser who founded Deaf Hands at Work, which provides training and employment for the deaf community. LifeCo Unlimited paid for his tools, helped him to get premises, and supported him as he set up his business. 23 deaf people now work for him as artisans. Charles now supports other social entrepreneurs, and that's why Charles is a worthy enterpriser. It all started with individual enterprises like William Machaba, Kim Smith, Sizwe Mamata, Johan de Meyer, Kolile Mazibuko, Lauren O'Donnell, Sharon Denny, Smitha Mystery, and more. LifeCo Unlimited SA is growing, aiming to deepen its work through South Africa and expand to the rest of Africa. And we are looking to partner with corporate supporters who offer pro bono mentorship and technical support to emerging entrepreneurs. What if we could together develop a network of partners that share this pan-African vision? Imagine the impact. The tentative startups of Unlimited in the UK in India and in South Africa were the first steps in what has now become a global movement. Unlimiteds have started popping up all around the world. In fact, it's now in over 40 nations globally, with the proud founder members of the now established global social entrepreneurship network being Unlimited UK, Unlimited India and LifeCo Unlimited SA. Social entrepreneurship has become a worldwide phenomenon now formally recognized and supported at the G8 and the World Economic Forum. So join us. As always, it all starts with an individual.